Okay, in this particular video, we're going to talk about how to pre-wire a window for a burglar alarm contact. Now, the wire that we're using here is a 22 gauge four conductor wire, so there are four teeny wires in there. The contact itself only requires two wires, but we always got into the habit of using a four conductor because other devices on the alarm system require four conductors, and it's nice to have a backup pair for whatever reason. Now, this particular contact, we decided to run it from the stool and up. So the wire is going to be exposed maybe a half inch along the face of the window jam, window frame, and then the contact will sit right here and the magnet will sit right here. And we thought that that was going to be the best situation for this particular window. Um, you can see that hole is a little bit smaller than 3 8 inch. It can be 3 8 inch, but that's a good size hole. Now another method is you can open the window and drill down inside the window and embed a contact in the window. But keep in mind, when you do that, there are two critical things you need to know. One is you void your warranty. Okay, You probably don't want to void the warranty on your brand new house. If you, if you really insist on doing it that way where you embed the contact in the window frame, you need to make sure you have a drill bit that drills a tap hole first and then the 3 8 inch hole second because this vinyl, a drill bit, walks so it makes a wobbly hole and the contact doesn't fit properly and you risk water getting down in there. And it gets in there and it eats up your, you know, you get mildew and stuff and it eats up your wood. You really don't want to do that. But, you know, some people insist on a concealed contact. And it, if I remember, I'll show you one in a different job. So, uh, that would be it. The other reason is, you know, because that hole wobble, you get that wobbly hole and the contact doesn't seal that hole. You can caulk it, but caulk shrinks and, you know, deteriorates over time. If water gets down in there... In this particular window, it sheds away because the way they engineered the window. And by the way, speaking of windows, this is a single hung window. So in other words, just the bottom portion opens. It can raise and lower. The top portion is fixed. If you have a double hung window, you probably want to contact both the top and the bottom. Take a look at every one of your windows to make sure they're all single hung like this. So that wire, we just drill a hole through this stud pack right here come out right there. I don't want to go up next to all this Romex in this particular case. Um, just too much going on right there so I moved it over one more stud cavity and then we just drilled up through the center of that top plate and took it back to where the main control panel is for this. So that's how to wire a window contact in a new construction house. Please subscribe to our channel. There are more videos on our channel regarding how to wire a house. Brought to you by the website www.allabouthomeelectronics.com So that's what a surface mount window alarm contact is going to look like. The white wire runs and ties into the contact itself and then on the right the part that sits on the movable window is just a magnet. But uh, you're always going to have a little bit of exposed wire like that. That's what it looks like. But, you know, usually it's covered by a window treatment or something like blinds. Okay, I, earlier I told you I wanted to show you a contact that's embedded in the window frame. Right, so there's the window frame. That's the contact. That's a 3 8 inch press-to-fit contact with clear silicone over it. And you can see how dirty it gets. I don't know how closely I can get to it with a good clear picture, but even if you look at the contact, it's got a wobble in it because this is just not the way to go. If driving rain hits this window, it uh, it doesn't have anywhere to go, so it risks, risks leaking down inside the window and rotting out your framing, but you don't want that. Now here's the magnet. Right? So that's the magnet right there. That's a rare earth magnet. It's just got two-sided sticky tape on it from the factory, and it's just attached to this piece of rubber. It's not a reliable installation. So if you don't do your windows correctly, you risk having some issues. Brought to you by the website www.allabouthomeelectronics.com For more information on this topic or other topics pertaining to home electronics, visit the website by clicking the link located directly below this video.